watching the station covering all of the DMV. DC News Now continues. And we continue now with a look at that heat advisory map. Now today will be a little bit hotter, a little bit more humid, meaning those heat index values will be a little bit higher than yesterday. So parts of our area under that heat advisory include north central Maryland. We're talking right around Hagerstown. Also the eastern panhandle of West Virginia over towards Martinsburg, even back over towards Kaiser and then parts of western Maryland back over towards Cumberland. Pawpaw also included in that heat advisory. That's from noon to 8 p.m. And it's where we could see those heat index values stretching up to 101 degrees at times later on this afternoon. At least we're tracking the dry conditions. Satellite and radar are showing us quiet weather starting off with those clear skies. We'll likely see a mix of sun and clouds out there for your Tuesday afternoon. Temperatures to start off your Tuesday though, 60s and 70s, already 75 right now in DC. We're into those low to mid 70s, Annapolis and Lexington Park, 74 Hagerstown. Starting off with those 60s though, the rest of the I-81 corridor. Those dew points are also on the rise right now. We're seeing those dew points varying from the 60s you're right around 70 degrees and we're seeing those dew points at 70 in Leesburg and Frederick. That's more that tropical feel to the air. So the higher the dew points, the more humid it feels and more moisture is in the air. Future cast showing us that later on today, at least by noon, we'll start to notice those temperatures climbing right around 90 degrees and we'll see those high temperatures low to mid 90s for much of the area for your Tuesday afternoon. We'll see those clouds also building up too at times, but overall mix of sun and clouds, partly sun filled out there for your Tuesday. Tuesday afternoon. Later on this evening around 7 p.m. That's when we start to fall back into those 80s and then eventually overnight tonight falling back into those 60s before we see those temperatures rise right around 90 degrees for your Wednesday for Juneteenth. So at least tomorrow won't be quite as hot as the day today. But that's still a prolonged period of high temperatures of at least 90 degrees. So again tomorrow also still a DMV first warm day, although those high temperatures won't be quite as hot as the day today. High today low to mid 90s for much of the area. 95 though expected for Hagerstown, Martinsburg, Frederick, upper 80s over towards Annapolis and Lexington Park. That water there, the Chesapeake, keeping those temperatures a touch cooler there. The forecast high temperatures over the next several days. We're looking at the peak of the heat. That will be Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Those high temperatures, upper 90s. And again, that's the air temperatures. That's not including the heat index values will likely be well into the triple digits. So that's something to keep in mind for the end of the weekend into the weekend. So in terms of the heat risk, I started showing this yesterday. Yesterday. Now, as we look ahead over the next several days today, that heat risk is at a two for much of the area. So that's on the lower end of things, but still definitely want to make sure that you are staying uh, up to date with the latest and also be a bit more concerned in terms of the heat and the impacts it could have on you and your family. Now tomorrow, not quite as high as a day today. We're looking at minor for much of the area aside from farther off towards the north and farther out towards the west. Then as we get towards Thursday, we start to notice more of that moderate color, more of that orange pushing its way closer towards DC. Then as we get towards Friday, as those temperatures will be back in mid to upper 90s, we see that orange across the area, but we start to notice some pockets of reds and reds indicating major. And then looking at Saturday and Sunday, Saturday, a lot more red on the map. And by Sunday, we're looking at extreme. We're looking at the higher end of that heat risk scale. We're looking at a lot of purples on this map. So certainly want to make sure that you are staying safe as we get towards this upcoming weekend and maybe uh, staying by the pool or making sure or you're heading to a splash pad too. that uh, that you are cooling yourself off. Here's to be the rest of that seven day outlook. So again, DMV first warm days today all the way through Sunday for also that uh, that peak of the heat, at least for the end of the weekend into the weekend. Uh, yes, summer solstice that is on Thursday. Certainly will feel like summer as we look ahead towards the end of the weekend into the weekend. And then as we get towards Sunday, some isolated thunderstorms expected that should cool things off uh, a little bit more as we get towards the start of that next work week. Monday, we're talking about high temperatures, low 90s, still some thunderstorms in the forecast too. Shanika, what's the latest on the road? Wait. All right, let's head out to